In this video, we will be looking at how to do a complete course reset. This means that everything in your course will be erased and it will essentially become a blank shell again. So like content assignments, all those things, quizzes will be gone and it will be just like a fresh shell. So in order to do this, we first need to go to course admin. So if you expand your nav bar and select course admin, then scrolling to the very bottom, you're going to see a course reset within the administration tab. So if we click on course reset, it gives you a warning saying course reset returns your course to an empty shell. This means all user data will be deleted and not available in data sets. All activities and content will be permanently deleted and cannot be restored. If you wanna see a little bit more about what's gonna be affected in terms of data that is cleared or data that is kept, Right. So, for example, things that are kept are user enrollment. So students will still remain. Sections will still remain. All those uh, those kind of things will remain. But everything that's gone is activities, files, grades, progress, data, uh, group enrollment. Uh, group enrollment gets deleted, but section enrollment gets uh, gets kept and all your course home pages, nav bars, widgets, etc. And that's optional. And you'll see that below. So down here, you actually get to um, select what exactly is gonna be reset. So first we're gonna click that, which just kind of initiates the reset, the reset process or allows you to reset it. Now you can keep group enrollments and categories if you want, and you can keep your homepage now burn widgets if you want. If you don't want to have those, you can um, select those and they'll be deleted as well. Or if you wanna keep them, uh, you can unselect them. Once you have your uh, appropriate options set, we're just going to click reset course. Now it does say that it gives you a warning. It says resetting this course will permanently delete this data. It cannot be undone by you, your organization or D2L. So we're just going to select we're aware of that and reset. And it says course um, reset is in progress. All right, and it says it's initiated by me and it will keep moving until it's done. So it takes a couple minutes and then once it's done, it's completed and you can look at the log and it shows you everything that it did. It went through and reset all this stuff. Okay, so that's how you do a complete course reset. Essentially, if you wanna bring in new content into your course and there's something that exists, instead of having to go through and delete everything individually, you can just do it all at once.